Hey there, welcome back. This time it's a trip to Tier 4 in the Chinese captured KI-43 Nakajami. Either the Oscar or the Hayabusa, depending on how you look at it. This is kind of a preview plane because at the time this came, Japan only had the one line. And it was the Imperial Japanese and Naval Line. Things have changed since then, obviously. Now we have a second line, which is the Imperial Japanese Army Line. Let's have a look at the plane itself. Sporting two 12.7 millimeter or 50 caliber machine guns, one airframe, and one engine. It's a premium plane. There's no upgrades. For equipment, I am running lightweight airframe, improved covering, and engine tuning. The pilot is the Hawk 3 pilot I've had since day one when Chinese planes were brought out. So he has Eagle Died, Engine Guru 1, and Cruise Flight. I have two points left over, trying to get a third, go for Engine Guru 2. From the paint department. This is what it looked like without it. Gad. This is one of the selectables. Kind of like that. Blah. I think that's actually been used. That could be semi-historical. I believe that could have been a what-if paint. This I got from a Christmas event. You can unlock a few paint jobs. And if memory serves right, this is pretty similar to how American captured 43s were painted up for evaluation purposes. This wild paint job I got, I think from an event. I can't remember specifically when, but I kind of like it. It's not too flashy, not, you know, Red Bull racing in your face kind of. So we went with that. So there we go. The plane, the parts, the pilot, the paint. Let's go participate. This used to be a real fun plane in the pre 2.0 days. Maneuverable and the same 12.7 millimeter or 50 caliber machine guns on this are also on the tier 3 Breda BA-27 but they've been adjusted slightly for tier 4. Yeah, The downside is I believe it still holds on to all of its Japanese frailties of being made of paper mache and catching fire if somebody looks at it cross-eyed. Literally, speed and maneuverability is all this thing really has going for it. And those two machine guns, yeah, they did put out some pretty good damage and the heat cycle was long for them. So I'm kind of curious to what it's like now. A tier 4 50 caliber should still be fairly good, but it's a machine gun. So it's going to be like a paper shredder of death with wings. Assuming I'm not outplayed. Okay. Good map, decent team. Good map, decent team. Good map, decent team. Ooh. I guess we'll go on to the decent team part. Airbase and the garrison. Well, obviously I'm going to go out to the garrison first because it's right there. I'll truck over to the airbase. You are approaching the area of combat operations. Be ready. It's a nice looking plane. I really do like how the Japanese kept their designs fairly clean and functional. Unfortunately, they're a little underwhelming. History has shown that. So we have one, two, three, four, five. Let's assume a five on five. You are approaching the front line. Off we go. Absolutely. Let's make this happen. Now it's going to be kind of interesting. 
the last few planes I played, A, were in lower tiers, and B, could actually take a bit of a pounding. So I'm kind of hoping that things will be favorable for me this time around. Yeah, Paper Shredder of Death is right, look at that, that's just terrible, and I had help. So they have already turned their garrison so quick. Okay. So this has a suggestion before everybody takes off in the middle, and then it's just game done. do -si do in the middle. Skippage there. Come on, there. Ooh, it's not looking. Yeah, everybody's going to the middle. Like, come on, guys. This could be a game. Ooh, bow fighter. Let's go over the boomerangs. You are under AA fire. No kidding. Oh, jeez. Let's not get this started already. In. Come on, we gotta chase these guys around. I think I'm the only guy here. Come on. Put a little twirl in it. Because if I'm being chased by a bot, sometimes it works. Like, really? Boomerang, go down. Thank you. That's one. I don't want the bow fighter, there's another boomerang. Oh, really? I'm lying in a hornet's nest here. I don't want to go head to head because I will not survive. This thing has no armor, really. Now I'm caught right over their AA, so it's a matter of trying to get this turn as quickly as I possibly could. Swoop down, grab some repairs. Come on, come on. I have at least one more plane to go, I think. Oh, and here comes the party. Oh, what do we got? Really? Boomerang over there. Wait, is that even in my sector? And my hit points are just being ripped away from me here. I knew that was eventually going to happen. Hmm. Looking for that bow fighter, right? Stand a bit of yeah. See, they've already captured all those. They're just chasing him around. Oh, it looks like it could be on the verge of rolling. And they're already working us over this way. Okay, so we rolled that. There's still nine to our six. And it's only just an IL-2, so no rear gunner to worry about. What is going on? Why is this dropping like that? Dropping down to 13. Oh, this is going to take a while. Not a frontline push fighter, so I think. <sighs> See, come on. Dang, burn it. Locked for 21 seconds. You I mean, know what? Let's just make your day interesting.
Lenham F. Now, he's tier 3. I shouldn't have that much trouble taking him down, even with his rear gunner. I think probably the best thing I could do would be play Defender here. Oh, seriously? Hello. This is what frustration looks like. Oh, now I'm overheated. <sighs> Twice, a bowfighter gets me. Well, no. I'm gonna stay here. I wanna defend this. I wanna re-flip it. This is still winnable. Still completely winnable. So let's. Holy! What's going on? Hang in there. You'll soon be cut off from support. I say again, support will not Come be on, available. What do we got? That is definitely an enemy teammate fighter over there. I don't think I can take him down faster with my two machine guns than he can with me on his rear turret. I don't believe that's in my favor. Oh, we rolled it good. That's a good sign. We have a GA that's in trouble. We cannot support you any longer. The storm is too heavy. Do you copy? Over. Get in there. He's gonna tail ride him. So, we've got the three flipped. It's looking pretty more positive now. Squall line's already in play. How should we do this? Okay, you look like you're going after him. There's a fighter inbound. Step it up! We're losing the battle! machine guns they're so precise you have to be right on the money with aiming them what are we looking for teams oh it could happen it's looking pretty positive I don't really want to wander around too far wait do we have no we do not have that so the guns would not even be in our favor uh, we lost two For you to do is die. That's all. Yeah, these guns are not nearly as good as they were in the pre 2.0 days for sure. Not gonna happen this time at all. Is that what a map? That's gonna take an hour to shoot down. Oh, I think I got lucky. Come on. Yeah, not looking good for us at all. Come on, come on. Even with help, he's just taking a very, very long time to go down. Like that is insane. Alt seven is going to go to eight in their favor. Fight to the bitter end. You've done what you could. Go back to base. Five forty to eight hundred. Wow. Wow. Well, just wasn't my battle that round. That's for sure. And it's frustrating. It's really frustrating. There was a glimmer of hope there. But that hope was fleeting at best. So let's have a look at the final scores here and see how we actually made out in the end. The old 
little summary tells me. Uh, I made better money off the tier 3. But we also won too. 7,000 was my best. Their best was 81. Wow. I did get 3, 8, and 120. Nevertheless, that's the Chinese version of the tier 4. Nakajima, KI-43, Hayabusa, or Oscar, depending on how you look at it. Would have been nice for a win. Just wasn't meant to be. If you liked what you saw, by all means, give me a thumbs up. Consider subscribing to my channel. Leave comments in the section below. What would you have done different? Where would you have gone? How could you have changed the outcome of this battle? By all means, share those thoughts with me. I would really like to see your tactics and strategy that would have made all the difference. Thanks for watching, and until next time, take care.